Hi everyone. So today I am going to do my makeup with you. I have no idea quite yet what type of makeup, um, but we will make it nice and fresh and something glowy and just something for everybody. So I just have my SPF on at the moment, which is the Neo Strata Enlighten SPF 35. Uh, I put that on a, a good while ago. So I'm going to go in with my tinted face cream next just to give myself a little bit of glow just a small amount onto the skin because i think my skin needs it i have um been doing a good bit of filming over the last few days so my makeup or my makeup my skin has been you know having makeup on and off and on and off a lot uh, so this is just going to give me look at that lovely glow love that um, okay, so for my foundation today, I think I'm going to use my hairbrush over there. Um, I'm going to use my, what did I use today? I think I'm going to use my Fresh Skin in the shade 3. I don't have a whole lot of tan on at the moment, so I don't need anything too dark. I'm going to bring you in a little bit, just so we're nice and clear. Um, and then pop on, oops, pop on my little clip to keep the hair back. So I thought I might fill you in on a few things that are going on if you have any interest. So we have a new shop opening very soon. Our first permanent shop, just putting a tiny bit of our um, shade tray on. Yes, yeah, so we have our first ever permanent shop opening in Cork at the end of this month. Well, realistically at this point, it'll probably be the beginning of next month. So we're looking at at the moment, the May bank holiday all going well. And um, I can't wait. I can't believe that we're going to have a permanent shop. Like it's nuts. You know, we were doing, we've had a few pop-ups now at this stage, never in Cork. Cork has always been on the list, but we've just found it so difficult to get somewhere down there. Um, and we really didn't want to settle for anything. So we looked at so many different units and finally, finally found what will be our home down in Mahon Point. Like you can see, I was testing eyeliners earlier. So I'm very excited about that. Um, I'm just tapping that in. Look at the coverage I've gotten there from such a tiny amount. I just love that foundation. I know I'm biased, but genuinely it is just so light and you get such great coverage with such a tiny amount. Um, I'm going to go in with my medium three concealer then just to brighten up under the eyes. So into the corners and then out on the edge to lift it up a small bit onto the lids as well because the lids are a bit red. Um, so we are at the moment recruiting for staff down in Mahon Point. Um, we have had lots of interest and, you know, would you believe I had a few messages from people saying they'd love the opportunity, but they felt, you know, maybe they might be too old for the position. Guys, there is no age limit on any position. We want to hear from everybody who has a passion for makeup and who loves AU because it's irrelevant what age you are. If you love makeup and you love to help people and you love to chat, that's really all that matters and um, so please do get in touch but it's really exciting so we have the first round of kind of zoom interviews this week and then hopefully next week we'll get down to cork to do the in-person ones so it's going to be a busy few weeks because we have um we have punches town coming up or i have punches town coming up i have i'm judging on the tuesday helping to judge with the most stylish and then on the friday i have booked a box for myself and the girls to go and have a day out and just enjoy it because there is a manic few few months ahead which will be all consuming so it's a nice little way to get out before it. I'm going to go in with some of my shade two of our loose powder just to set set the little few bits that I want to set up and make up there just on the chin nose and between the brows this loose powder um, we have our shade one coming back very soon it's so so light so finely milled you will have no caking uh, no drying of the skin you can't even feel it basically on the skin it's so lovely and light but really it makes such a difference just to knock back any shine and um, keep everything in place all day long yes then I have another few 
bits coming up, just kind of work related things that I have coming up. So it's just going to be manic time. And um, yes, yeah, so it'll be lovely to get out to Punchestown and get racing for the few days. I'm going to do my lips actually before I go on. Lips and brows, I always feel are the two that need a little bit of something. I'm just going to shade in. And um, what I'm going to do next is my eyebrows, just because I always think that they make such a difference once they're done. So I'm just going to brush, brush them into place. I think the key to this video will be just to show you how little you need. Total opposite to what I did the other day when I was doing Mary the Duxbury's uh, foundation routine. I'm just going to look in the mirror here behind. This is our easy brow pencil and gel, or our brow pencil and gel, sorry, in the shade brown. Um, but just to show you the, the coverage you can get and just how little you really need. Like genuinely, I'm just going to take my little bronzer Blush and bronzer palette to get my mirror closer. Like even look at the difference, a bit of definition in the brows makes. Crazy. I'm trying to think of what else I have to fill ye in on. So I, uh, I'm still doing lots of running. People have been asking because I hadn't been posting I just haven't been great at posting lately anything to be honest but i'm working away at my running i have had a few issues with my hip again but it was because i stopped doing my band work as we always do the minute you start getting better you're like oh it's grand i don't need to do it anymore and then the trouble comes in again so i've been really rigid with that and a few races coming up that i want to um i want to give the bash to and hopefully do well at I'm just trying to get my times a little bit better, but I'm trying not to put myself under too much pressure either with this year because we just have so much in work going on that I just, I need that to be my escape. I don't need to be stressed with it. Um, I'm going to go in with my Natural Glow Blush and Bronze Palette um, now. And as you can see, I could do it with myself a new one and my little angle contour brush. I'm going to give myself a little bit of bronze first, just on the cheeks, just to give a little bit of warmth. And then down my nose. I have a big birthday coming up soon as well in a couple of weeks. Actually, it's less than two weeks away now. So I'm not having a big party or anything like that. I'm, I'm not a big party type, but we are doing a nice family dinner. So I got myself a new dress and shoes. Um, and I'm looking forward to getting glammed up for it and just having a nice evening out with the family. But that'll be that'll be well enough for me quite boring in that sense and um, so i have those two on now i'm going to go in with just a little bit of my liquid lights highlight as my glow on top and actually to be honest our natural glow palette has a little bit of a glow so if you don't want to go in with a liquid over it you don't need to you have plenty enough in that and then just tap that into the cheeks like look at that lovely glow just makes the skin look so healthy i think um, and then for the eyes, I am going to go in with, I think I'm going to use my dusty pink. I haven't used my dusty pink in a while. Where is it there? Not typical now. I haven't used it for ages. And I was thinking, wouldn't that be nice to throw on? And now I can't find it. So maybe instead I'm going to go in with my olive. Because I just want to give a nice sweep to the lid. Because I, I really just kind of want to show you how nicely they go on and how easy they are to use. So I'm just going to scribble it over the middle of my lid just like that and then blend it out with my ring finger these are so just so easy to use i can't even stress that enough um, and because like that the pencil you can put on as much or as little as you like and you're not gonna have to worry about fall down or anything like that they're so nice to use as well as a base for a smoky eye so say if you Forgive my nails, they're getting done next week. They're just in bits because I'm forever opening big boxes and throwing stuff around the place. And then with the horses as well, they just can't, I can't keep them. And it's something I'm always so conscious of because I know my job, my hands are always on show. 
Um, but what was I saying there? Oh yeah, it's a lovely, these are a lovely base for a smoky eye as well, because you, when you put the cream down and then you put a powder over it, it just will intensify that cream, or sorry, intensify that shadow so much. And it just makes it really, really gorgeous and real velvety. It gives such texture to your color. So I'm just putting an extra bit down on the lower part, just to make it a little darker down there. And again, these are buildable. So if you want to go super dark with it, you can. So I'm just going to pop that there. That's nice. And then I'm going to go in with a little bit of my brown liner from my liner and lashes because daytime I don't really like to use too much black unless you know obviously off somewhere but this is just really to give me a little bit of an outline. Some of my olive kind of got on my waterline as well anyway. Cool. And then I'm going to go in with my brown mascara from that eyeshadow, eyeshadow, can't talk, that brown mascara from the liner lashes as well. I love the size of this wand because you get such precise placement of the product and it literally just clings to the lashes so you're not going to get it all over your lid. And give a nice coat on top. So that's just one little layer of my mascara with it and my makeup all finished. So something very simple. I think just really nice and natural and for me, perfect for day to day, but again, so simple. So it doesn't have to be loads of products. I know some of you are probably like, there's a fair amount there. But no, if you just have those core products, you get that really gorgeous glow to your skin. And I just think it makes you feel so much better. So I hope you enjoyed that one and I will talk to you soon.